Very recently, WooCommerce introduced their really simple featured video for WooCommerce, basically. So this is where for your products, you can now have a video and obviously you could drop in a widget. Now, they do charge $4 per month and I know some people are like, oh wow, this is really, really cool. We can now add videos. I'm gonna show you how you can do this completely for free, just using the advanced custom field. So this plugin you can get for free. There is a premium version, but the free that we're gonna use here is completely okay. And this is gonna save you spending four dollars per month for something so minor and simple once you've installed that plugin go down to acf and then go to field groups what we're going to do is create a field called video and we're only going to enable it for the woocommerce products let's go and click add new i'm just going to call this one woocommerce products like that and down here i'm now going to go and create my field the field will be a URL and I'm going to call it a video. I'm then going to scroll down and I'm going to say the post type is equal to product and then I'm going to hit save changes. You've got to make sure you do it for the product otherwise it won't be visible. Now I'm going to go over to my product and I'm just going to go to one of these ones over here. We'll go to the styler one, hit edit, scroll down until I get to my field which is now video. That's how simple and easy it is if you want to add some custom fields to your products. So I can add in whatever I want here. I've gone over to YouTube and I'm now going to click share and I'm going to copy the share link over there. By the way, if you are ever copying links, please don't use the link at the top over here because that's not good for YouTube algorithm. Believe me, it hurts the influencer. Okay, go and get the share link and I'm now going to enter that in over here like that. That's literally it. That's it. And then I hit update. And you could do this for Vimeo as well. Now, what if the video is actually in your media library? You can still use the URL link there. It won't make any difference. Now let's go over to our templates. I'm going to grab the video widget. And by the way, we are using Elemental Pro. I'm just going to stick the video there. I mean, you would obviously stick it wherever you want. And with different page builders or theme builders, you'll have different ways of doing this. But the URL link will work absolutely fine. Now at the moment, this is just pulling through a dummy video, but you see where it has the dynamic tags. I'm going to click that, scroll down until you get to ACF. Now you could, if you want, if you had done this as a text area as well, or a text field, technically it can still work as well, but I set it up as a URL field. I'm going to click that. It's not going to bring anything across because I've got to now tell it which field exactly. Click the spanner or the wrench. I'm now going to say, give me the video that is now activated. However, you can't see anything because this is the Roma product and we did it for the styler. So if you were now, if you went and built this and you now went to a product where there has been no video value added, don't worry about this. Look, this is what you'll see. It's absolutely fine. So you don't have to worry about that. But if you were to now go to the actual styler product, video is now there. Now, obviously, this is coming through YouTube, so you're going to have all the YouTube stuff there. But if you were now going to pull it, say, from your media library, you would have put in the URL for that. You know, when you go over to your media library, you can have the URL link. By the way, though, when you are looking at the single template, it might still show that. But when you go to preview, the video is definitely there and it is definitely going to play. So if you want to add videos to your WooCommerce products, you can do that with advanced custom field and you don't have to pay $4 a month because I'm telling you now, $4 a month just to bring over a video. I feel a bit like, really? Like, really, really, really? You don't need to do that. And you're not bloating your database if you're pulling it from YouTube or Vimeo. And for anyone that goes, yeah, but I don't want the product on YouTube, or I do, but I don't want anyone to find it. Well, just set it up as say an unlisted video then. But this is a really quick and simple way of doing it. Hey, I'm Imran from Web Squadron. I hope you like, subscribe, share, and follow. I'll see you soon. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game, win it life, have no shame, there's no time, feel the pain, let the grind, I could change, in my mind, pick a lane, commit and climb, the only way, to win it life, I never miss that fact, taking big swings, bitch, hand me the bat, put me in the ring, you'll go out in a bag.